Welcome to Angelo Costa here in uh, Palazzo Widman uh, at uh, Architects Meet in uh, Fori Biennale at Off Event. A um, few questions for a few answers. Um, who are you, your name, your age, your nationality, where do you live in the world and uh, if you have uh, a city where you dream to, to live in and to work in? Uh, Angelo Costa, Italian. Uh, Spanish education, Italy Spanish education, US education, work in Rome, work in New York, London, Dubai, um, architect but also entrepreneur. I love my country very much. I should, uh, I would like it would be better. My favorite cities where to live actually in the world would be San Francisco and Berlin. Why? Because I think that there is the right mix of the highest quality life ever, in both of them, which is um, a mix of right people, right tech, right uh, um, education, right uh, climax, um, and a, a lot of more things that mix all together got the highest rank for <laughs> the for any for the global cities uh, but i know you you work a lot also in emirates uh, yeah, so wh what about emirates why why not emirates my studio is in dubai uh, we work a lot there and uh, of course when we talk about dubai and emirates uh, dubai it's a, it's a it's a special island in the middle of uh, the gcc uh, it's a very good place it's a very it's a perfect place where to live, but uh, I mean, you always look for more. There is a lot of work, so this is why we architects uh, went there, and I'm still there. But uh, I mean, I, I don't live there, I just work there. I live mostly in Roma, Venezia, London, New York. And um, who are your partners? I mean, uh, who do you like to work with, and why? Which, what is the link uh, with uh, your co-workers? You mean my co-workers in studio in or the world, in the world? In your studios. Uh, I mean, the people that work for me or with or together. It depends on the situation. I don't know. Um, I really like to work with uh, with everybody. Uh, I, I really like to work with people that are uh, both highly specialized in what they do, but also highly open mind in uh, team working, in co-working. Because, and it's not very easy to find this kind of people, and also this kind of companies, because there are a lot of very nice and very cool engineers company or architect companies that or artists because we like to work all together that okay but that is just say I uh, but uh, this is the way it has to be done so there is no way out to say wow this is not the only way there's hundreds thousands millions of ways to do something and we have to agree all together which is the best way and you are not here just to impose your own way uh, most of the companies work this way and the partners of the companies used to work in this day in this way and I don't like this kind of people I like the kind of people that uh, let's all talk together and uh, let's figure out open mind which is the world solution um, can you give me three uh, keywords so that um, at best uh, represent your your work uh, your architectural mood hmm uh, quality um, uh, I would say design and now I learn another uh, word tweak that is huh that is there is a uh, Peter Cook say trick. We have to make a little step, a little adjustments. And uh, I really believe in the philosophy that we architects, we don't have to work for change the world. We don't have to work for, look for the architecture, the, the revolution. Starting from the little. 
we have to every day tweak, tweak, tweak our work in order that it has to be that could be better every day, every day a little bit better. And there is a work that for you is more representative of of you, and that is uh, you're proud. Uh, there is a work, uh, yes. Uh, there there are a uh, few works. Um, one of the best, uh, uh, there, the best, uh, two best I've, I've been, I did is one here close to Venice. It's a master plan, which I'm very proud of it. Uh, and another, it's um, how can I say? It's a, oh, oh, a beach club in in Dubai. And there is like a, a music or an an artwork that you would associate to these two works. Uh, not really. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I've never thought about it. But uh, no, never thought. Yes, there is uh, one. One is. It's not an artwork for the master plan here in Venice. Uh, there is a sound, and there is a mood, which is uh, the sound of not this boat, but the sound of the the lagoon of Venice. And the, the, and the, uh, when uh, when it flows, when the water slowly flows, like flush, flush, like wonderful. <laughs> like. Um, there is any suggestion that you would give to a, a young architect? To the young architects, yes. Uh, my suggestion is to um, to to be. Uh, uh, how can I say? Uh, to try to work every day to make little steps in order to be better, and never think that uh, uh, you are the only one. Your architecture is the only one, and uh, your sign is the best. There are th hundreds, thousands, millions of architects that all work well or work good, and we have all to work together in order than the what is uh, the, our real devil, the non-architecture, could be transformed in all architecture. And this is a real huge job, because if you think about it, in the in the world, if you make a hundred, the world the the world of construction that in uh, I mean in in, in only uh, buildings, uh, zero point zero one percent is uh, uh, you know experimental architecture. The maybe the one percent is uh, very good architect arch architecture. Then there is another five percent that is that is made by good architecture architects. The rest, which has is m something like ninety three percent, is made by nobody, and this is what is uh, destroying our cities, our neighbors, our uh, uh, mm, our surroundings. So we have to fight against this. We have to really fight. This is the devil. We have to fight against this. So there, there, is, a, there is a book that you would, would suggest uh, in architecture? There are a lot of books. None of them is an architect's books. One? Uh, perché la, uh, it's, uh, I don't know the name in, in English. But the name in Italian is uh, Perché la città si è fatta straniera by Erich Boll. Okay. <laughs> and the last question is, uh, mm, uh, how do you think will be uh, architecture after the star system in your mind, uh, from your point of view? Well, it's what you have now. So the star system is already dead. Um, few do you think so? Yes, I really think so. Star system is over already over. The star systems uh, are already gone. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much to Angelo Costa here from uh, Palazzo Widman and uh, see you at the party later and yes. all around in Biennale. Thank you so much. Bye bye.